Can I build a greenhouse in Blogsburg, but I have to use every single gardening item in the game? I started by making the shape and the walls of the greenhouse. I have built a greenhouse before, when back when the gardening update came out with the bees and added lots of plants. Um, so I've got my very kind of similar vibe here, but of course I have to use every single plant now, and back then I only used a couple. As obviously this is a greenhouse, I think some places call them glass houses, but either way, they are obviously made of glass. At least most of them are, and at least the one I'm building is going to be made of glass. Um, for the roof of the original one I made, I made glass panels and I transformed them to be arched ways. However, I recently found out in a speedboat I'm doing at the moment, which I haven't posted yet, but it's coming soon, um, I added a conservatory onto the back and I did this trick where I used the transparent triangular cubes and I just added the lines onto that. So it looks like it's an arch panel, but it is secretly not. And honestly, I may do a video on just like this in like a specific tutorial in the YouTube short because this is like a banging technique. This is great. It literally saves like 10 times the amount of time and it looks just as good. And I think it's probably also a lot cheaper and doesn't require the transform tool. Like I was talking about earlier with my original greenhouse I built, um, originally I did use transparent blocks for all the walls and I did beams and stuff to make custom windows. However, I was thinking it was just like a lot of work and it kind of, it looked really good. I really like that build. I think it's my most like post on Instagram. It was really popular. People really like it. But I do think it wasn't necessary to do all that work. You could just use windows and the triangular cube roof like I was talking about. And it does give basically the same effect. And it's also like, 10 times cheaper and 10 times less time to do. So if you're building a greenhouse or a conservatory or anything glass, I recommend this process because like, look at it, that looks just as good. If not, possibly even better because I think it looks much more sleek and less thick and kind of messy like. I finished the shape and like the shell of the build I'm now going in with all the plants it was very difficult with this build trying to not make everything look really overcrowded and messy because obviously that's like very easy to do when you're adding about 30 different plants and trees and a big tool I used was the scale tool as well because obviously I'm using a bunch of trees um, I didn't have the room to have a bunch of these huge trees in the back so I made a lot of them much smaller and I used them as plants inside and stuff like that the only thing I had to work around was that the plant trees, like with um, apple trees, lemon trees, lime trees, and the orange trees, you can't scale them to make them any smaller because they have like interactive abilities because you can like pick plants off them. So those I had to keep on the outside as like a part of the build, which did kind of mess with my color schemes because I did want to go for a more aesthetic kind of color scheme. But in the end, I had to go much more colorful because I had to bring in all the fruit colors from these trees.
And now that I have added a ridiculous amount of plants, here is the final product. Overall, this actually ended up being worth 85,000 bucks of cash, which is like ridiculous, but I think it looks cool. I think it does look a bit messy, but it kind of works and it's kind of a cool vibe. Um, here's the interior, obviously using every single plant. I think it really went well. And yeah, thanks for watching. <laughs>